you are about to face some challenges. But you might as well go ahead anyway and face those challenges because if you don't, you have a whole nother set of challenges to face. You know, it's, it's, it's an amazing thing, man, how people sit around and they watch other people strike out to become successful and they sit in the stands watching these people play out these games and they and they and they criticize, they boo, they laugh at their efforts and everything. And they talk about the failures. He missed that game when he shot, boy, he sucked. Man, he did this, he ain't worth that. I hear people who sit in stands, who criticize people who are out there on the playing field. Now, when you're on the playing field, you have a set of challenges in front of you. You're going to be open to criticism. You're going to be open to ridicule. You're going to be talked about when you don't know the people who are talking about you. Now, here's the upside to being the player on the field that's facing all the challenges, the criticism, the laughing, the joke, the being talked about. He has something going for him. This person, boy, woman, child, girl, man, has an opportunity to win. They have an opportunity to win. And in the game of life, just cause you lose one of the games or you lose one of the matches, it don't mean you've lost. You don't get put out. You keep playing. And when you're playing, here's the upside. You have the opportunity to win. And but guess what? You're going to win some of the matches. You're going to win some of the points. You're going to make some of the dunks. You're going to hit some of them over the wall. You're going to hit some out the park. You're going to score some goals. You will if you're playing the game. Here's the problem with the people who don't face the criticism, who nobody boos or cheers for, who sits in the stands and knows neither victory nor defeat. Those people, without realizing it, are facing a set of challenges also. And the challenges they're facing is how I'm going to live with myself, what I'm going to do now, what direction am I going in? Where am I going to live? Wonder what job will hire me. Wonder if I can get paid for criticizing. Oh, woe is me. I can't find the purpose in my life. And man, I'm just waking up in a state of confusion. I don't know what to do. Now, let me ask you something. Which one of them set of challenges you'd rather be faced with? Because if I'm on the flow playing, if I'm on the field playing, if I'm out on the court playing, then guess what? I got a chance at winning. But guess what I'm doing every day while I'm playing? I'm strategizing. I'm waking up with a purpose. I'm waking up trying to come up with another angle. I'm in pursuit of a goal every single day versus the people in the stands who know neither victory nor defeat. Get in the game, face the challenges, better yourself, better your wife, better your children, better your condition, better your employment status, better your job, better your career. Take a shot, come on man, what you waiting on? Because the alternative is to watch other people play the game. You know what I just do sometimes? Sometimes I just, I get Forbes magazine or Money magazine. Or sometimes I still grab a copy of the Rob Report. I just flip through it just to see. Get, I used to get these, this book called Unique Homes. Unique Homes is a magazine that just has a lot of extravagant houses that's on sale across the country, across the world. I used to just flip through it. Let me just see what the people that's playing the game out there do. Stop watching other people become successful when you could very easily be you, if you make the decision. But when you make the decision to become successful, get ready for a series of challenges. 
I think it's more difficult not to accept the challenge. I think it's, for me, this is just for me, it may not be the case for you. For me, I think it's far more difficult to wake up and just see how life gonna go today. Cause man, it could just deal you any kind of hand today. You understand? I, I don't like, you know, spades. Let, let's talk card game, for example. The game of spades, really man, it ain't a whole lot you can do if you don't get no spades. Really? It's a little couple of little strategies you gotta do, but you can have all this ace, king, queen, diamond all you want, but man, you ain't got no spades, they cutting them, you're in trouble. Be it whist, different game. You can create what's in your hand. You got dealt a hand too, but you can create a hand. You can call a trump. You can make diamonds your spades. You can make hearts or clubs your spades. That's what I'm saying, that's what it is. You can do something with it. It's a different game, man. I, you can strategize. I would rather have a say-so in my life than to wake up every day and just see how it's going. I think it's more difficult to not accept the challenge to be something than it is to accept the challenge to be something. I think it's more difficult to sit around and not be nothing. I think it's harder to watch everybody life going somewhere but mine. I think it would be very difficult for me to sit here and hear them talking about other people and never mention my name. It would be difficult for me to see everybody rise and getting promotions except me. I, that would be difficult for me. I, it may not be for you, but for me it would be quite challenging. I would rather accept the challenge of making something out of my life than to sit there and criticize those and then watch and see how my life just may go. Okay, just a thought today. <laughs>